Okay, so today I'm going to be showing you a Nexus One ROM running on my iPod Touch. It is a custom ROM, and so it looks a little bit different than an official Nexus One Android ROM, but it is um, pretty close. So as you can see there in the background, you can already see the Nexus One kind of line, um, red line, you know, blue, green, yellow line back there, and then we have this. Sorry about that. We have the launcher thing, little app drawer. And I don't have very many apps in there, so I can't really show you the scrolling. But um, we have that. Let me go like this. And then these right here are programmable like hotkeys you could say and then if you push this twice then it'll bring the standard iOS 4 little multitasking menu down here so um, with this ROM You'll get some cu custom things, like some colors, and here, let me, that's an Android sound if you didn't know, unlock, Android unlock, as you can hear, it has the droid power club like that, as you can see, loading, Android market, and we also have a lot It's kind of hard to make out, but we have the, the logos, the Android Nexus One logos on here. See right there, and everything works. Everything works great. I've encountered no problems with this particular ROM, and um. This is just like a quick overview of this ROM. It does turn landscape, unfortunately. Like, it will turn landscape to landscape games and stuff, like the browser. But, um, that's pretty much it and it will turn landscape and certain things just not on the home screen with, as of with some android roms it will it is a custom rom so it's not like an actual um, nexus one rom it has to be custom i mean you can put a, a nexus one rom on here but it isn't as stable as a custom rom As you can see down here, you have the little indicators right there, indicating which screen you're on. And you have your Gmail. So that's just a quick little overview of it, of the Nexus One custom Nexus One ROM running on, running on an iPod Touch. But only eight gigabytes. But um, and the drop the bar. It has like little notifications. Like if you get a text message, you can see it, but you can't drop it down, unfortunately. So that's just a quick little overview. Hope you guys enjoyed. This has been a Leaf Tech One overview. Rate, comment, and subscribe. I also do sub for subs. Thanks. Bye.